Lameness in sheep is still a significant problem in the UK. Some farmers are still experiencing levels of up to 10% or above in their ewe flocks. The bacterial diseases, foot rot and scold, still constitute a major proportion of this problem, spreading disease from sheep to sheep via contaminated ground surface. They're complex and tricky diseases to deal with, and grumbling levels of lameness can easily explode into wider outbreaks in no time at all. In 2011, the Farm Animal Welfare Council, FORC, recommended that the prevalence of lameness should be reduced to less than 5% by 2016 and less than 2% by 2021. The five-point plan is designed to help farmers to achieve and exceed these goals. The five-point plan was developed by us at FAI by bringing together scientific research coupled with practical farm-level knowledge and experience. In our own 1,200-strong ewe flock, when the five-point plan was adopted, lameness was reduced from an average annual prevalence of 8%, with a seasonal peak of over 19%, to less than 1%, and has remained at this low level for the last four years. In 2014, it was agreed by industry stakeholders that the five-point plan would be adopted as the national strategy for achieving control in lameness to fork targets. This short infographic is aimed at showing us why it's important to implement the whole five-point plan and how you have the very best chance of success if you're able to do this in its entirety. So the five points of the plan do three things. The first is building resilience in the ewe flock, creating a healthy and robust flock more able to tolerate disease. The second is establishing immunity, using vaccination to give ewes much needed additional protection. These two measures are both positive and we're aiming to build these. The third point is all about reducing disease challenge. It's about reducing bacterial load in the environment and we really want to reduce this negative measure. So it's all about building the two positives, reducing the negatives, redressing the balance. More specifically, the five points of the plan are fit together like this. Building resilience by culling out your worst offenders, establishing immunity using vaccination, and the three points of the plan relating to reducing disease challenge are all about avoiding spreading disease at handling and in the field surface, treating lame sheep rapidly to stop them spreading disease, and quarantining incoming animals to prevent you bringing in new or different strains of disease. The real power of the five point plan comes in putting all of these actions together. The measures in the five point plan are synergistic. In other words, they feed off each other, they work in combination to generate enough protection to allow you to get control. The measures are not simply additive and cutting corners can mean that you just don't get the value out of the investment in time and resources. There's a critical tipping point when you implement all of the actions together. You're generating enough gain in the positives coupled with enough reduction in the negatives which gives you this control. In addition to this, you have enough margin of safety such that when the odds become stacked out of favour, you are still protected from disease. For example, a spell of warm, damp weather or at winter housing time. In a situation where there are grumbling or even high levels of lameness, the natural resilience of the flock may be poor. For example, if many ewes have suffered from lameness in the past, they may have poor, misshapen, diseased feet. They may also not have been vaccinated against foot rot and the disease challenge in the environment is high due to the accumulation of foot rot bacteria in high traffic areas, at handling and in pasture. Lameness may be introduced by brought in replacement stock and lame sheep may not be promptly treated. In this situation, the flock is likely to suffer from grumbling and seasonally high levels of lameness. When implementing the five point plan, the aim is to redress this balance, build the positives, reduce the negatives and create a margin of safety to give you all year round protection. So we're building the two positives, culling out repeat offenders and use with chronic misshapen feet, vaccinating to give baseline immunity and also simultaneously implementing the three actions which together reduce disease challenge. Lameness is a complex and tricky disease to manage. It still affects a lot of sheep in the UK and the five point plan is a practical tried and tested solution to help farmers reduce lameness levels towards fork targets in flocks.